guys, Sarah here. Today I'm going to do an affordable, all-natural, non-toxic, clean, green beauty skincare routine with you that is also very K-beauty inspired. And I know that green beauty can sometimes be a little bit like in the luxury level or intimidating, so I wanted to show products to you that are really effective and very, very affordable that live around the $10, $15 mark. I'm really honored that this video is in collaboration with iHerb. I'm a big fan. I've been a loyal customer since 2012. In Korea, they have been my go-to to get anything that I wanted natural food-wise, clean skincare, vitamins, supplements, even my washing detergent for my clothes was from iHerb. I had it shipped over. So it's basically been a lifesaver for me. There's so much to choose from. There's 30,000 different natural products on their website and they ship to 150 countries, including Korea. And so if you have difficulty finding products that you liked like I did, this could be an amazing option for you. You never have to worry about the quality of your products because everything is coming from climate controlled distribution centers. And I also found that everything was really fast shipping. They also offer customer service that's 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and in 10 languages so if you ever have problems you know that there's somebody there to help you for this video I wanted to put together a very accessible routine that you can do at home some of these products I've been using for a really really long time like since I joined iHerb in 2012 um, and then some I'm just picking up now because I like the look of them the ingredient deck is really clean as you know I'm obsessed with clean beauty I think it's really important to put non-toxic products on your skin because your skin is your largest organ of the items that are actually listed on EWG or Environmental Working Group Skin Deep website, a lot of them run at one. Some of them are not listed, but I can tell by looking at the ingredient list, they would be a one. I've even included one wellness supplement because beauty is also what you put in your body. And so this one is very, very exciting. So stick around to the end for that one. Like I said, everything is around $10, $15 with the exception of one item, which is less than $30. So I will put everything in the description box below. You can check it out there. So the first product is this, this Insta Natural Rose Makeup Cleansing Balm. I love Korean cleansing balms. It's amazing for emulsifying the makeup off of your face at night. Um, but I don't necessarily love all the ingredients in them. A lot of them are petrochemicals, synthetics um, that I am not loving. This one smells great. This is, smells like rose. Uh, but this one is completely all natural. It's beautiful. It is this kind of like sorbet texture. So you just put it on dry skin, rub it in, massage your face, and it will emulsify the makeup off. It doesn't come off as easy as other synthetic balms so you would use a warm washcloth or something like this this is a charcoal cognac facial sponge this is from eco tools i love these i've had multiple ones um it's actually made of cognac root which is a vegetable fiber and it's fully biodegradable so it has a very lovely light exfoliation and so i just use it with the balm to help move it across and then again with a foam cleanser this feels so cool and so luna actually loves this she always steals them from me so if you happen to have a toddler that doesn't like to wash their face this might be your answer balm. so after the cleansing balm i am using the alafia neem turmeric cleanser and I'm loving this because the price is right. It is under $10. The ingredient list is incredible. The company has a lot of ethical practices. If they use palm oil, it is orangutan safe and will clearly say so on the packaging. They do a lot of women's empowerment projects, ethical trade, vegan, no animal testing, paraben free, biodegradable ingredients. So anyway, they're an amazing company. I like all of their products. There's no synthetic fragrances. Yes. And um, to top it off, it doesn't dry out my skin. <laughs> it takes everything off, but it doesn't dry. And that to me is just amazing. It has neem and turmeric. So if you have hyperpigmentation like I have, it's supposed to even out skin. It's supposed to um, help inflammation, but definitely like with hyperpigmentation and uneven skin tone or skin that is prone to breaking out, this is um, supposed to be very good for you. 
So after cleansing my face, I like to mist with a toner or rose water. Organic rose water is the best. I'm true hydrosol. This is the purest that I have found on iHerb, which is the Instant Natural Organic Rose Water. It's great to pack in moisture into your face. It actually has beneficial properties. So this is full of antioxidants. There's vitamin A, there's vitamin C. It is nourishing, it's moisturizing, it, mat um, it balances your pH. It has a very slightly astringent quality. I mean, it doesn't hurt or anything, um, but it will help close your pores. And it's overall anti-inflammatory. It's amazing if you put it in the refrigerator in a hot summer day and you wanna mist your face, you can use it as a makeup setting spray. Um, you can use it for pretty much anything. I know that some cultures actually have rose water in their tea or in their food. So rose water is pretty amazing. Um, I have been using rose water for a very long time. I think it's a great toner and it's great to be able to pack in moisture that is not your tap water, which also has chlorine. I'm very excited to share with you next the serum that I've been using for a very long time. I think I bought this when I first joined iHerb uh, in 2012. This is the Mad Hippie Vitamin C Serum. It has been my go-to. I mean, I love trying all different vitamin C serums and I will continue to do so, but this is one that I will always continue to like have as well and fall back on and like bounce back and forth from because I really, really love it. It's very moisturizing. It has hyaluronic acid in it. It has ferulic. It has cognac root. Um, and then the type of vitamin C, the derivative, is sodium ascorbyl phosphate which apparently is more shelf stable and also more bioavailable and has anti-acne properties. Yes, please, I will take it. Um, so this is a different vitamin C that you might see in more natural products. The ingredient list is incredible. I, this price range is around like 27, 25, 27 dollars. So this is the most expensive item on my list, but um, I think it is worth it because the ingredient deck is so great. I've read really amazing reviews on it. Um, yeah, so you might find a vitamin C serum that's $18, but then when you look at the ingredient deck, you're also paying for cheap fillers. The vitamin C in here is also a non-GMO form, which most vitamin C is GMO derived. So that's a huge plus for me. It's also ranked as a number one on EWG's Skin Deep website, which there aren't many vitamin C's that rank that. And da da da, if it, I'm not raving enough about it, it's the best seller on iHerb, so um, it's easy to find. So after applying the vitamin C serum, I would like to do a little spot treatment, and I have picked up, this is the first time I am using this, is the organic Tamanu oil from Aracacia. I love this brand, Aracacia. I buy all their um, essential oils because I love the organic quality, and also they have um, a childproof cap, which is really important when you have a small toddler around. But this Tamanu oil is supposed to be very, very good for hyperpigmentation. So I just put a very little, I love the smell. Some people don't really like the smell, but it's a very herbaceous green smell. I think it's beautiful. But I just tap it into the areas where I have hyperpigmentation or melasma, which is here and here. And I've heard amazing reviews online. So I'm very excited to try this. It is a little bit emollient, it's a thicker oil, so I only put a little bit on the spots that I need it. Another product from Aracacia is this organic rosehip oil. I have been using this again probably since 2012. It is my go-to oil, facial oil, um, and also like moisturizer in general for the face. Believe me, it's not gonna break you out. It actually gives you an amazing glow. It has um, naturally occurring vitamin A. It's also full of essential fatty acids, omega-369. Um, apparently also has vitamin C. So there's just a lot of like brightening, anti-aging pro um, properties in it that occur naturally. It is so affordable. You know, it lives around the $9 price point. It is an essential thing I think to have if you're trying to have a cleaner but very effective skincare routine, rosehip oil is incredible. Our Acacia also has these great pump tops which keep their oils fresh. Not all oils need to have um, pumps or oxidize in a certain way, but it's really helpful especially for the rosehip oil. I will put this all over my face twice a day. I like to use it a little bit more at night. 
Um, sometimes I will use it as a final step because it is also very moisturizing. So it's just like an easy, easy step and I don't even have to think about my nighttime routine very much. Get the glow, get the glow, get the glow, get the glow. Botanical oils are the way to go. Okay, that was weird. Okay, have, can you tell that I'm like obsessed with um, oils, like botanical oils? They are amazing. You know, I have a lot of serums that are lots of blends of amazing oils and the prices are kind of up there. So it's very exciting for me to be able to introduce, you know, really affordable single oils that are effective and that you can maybe blend at home or just use individually. The last one that I've added is the squalane oil from Life Flow. It is pure olive, so sometimes squalane comes from non-vegan um, animal products. So look for ones like this Life Flow one that is from olives. Squalane is very similar to your skin's own sebum, so it helps you um, manage your own sebum production. You just put a couple of extra drops and it's very moisturizing. So this is a really affordable way to have a moisturizer without any extra filler. It's just, it just works. You will find in the Green Beauty World, uh, individual squalane bottles will be, you know, in the $30 mark. Um, I think this was like under 15 and then you also see it being used in the ingredient deck of a lot of amazing high-level green beauty brands or green beauty products another thing is that you can put a couple of drops into whatever moisturizer you use already just to like boost the moisture the last thing for my daily skincare routine is always an spf no matter where you live you should be using spf i'm always looking for a mineral physical sunscreen because chemical sunscreens could be toxic to you, but they're also not reef safe. So um, most famously recently, you're finding that Hawaii has banned oxybenzone or sunscreens with oxybenzone. It's killing the coral reefs. And so it's really important to me to wear reef safe sunscreen. And as well, if it's killing the coral, it's probably not very good for you either. So <laughs> something like zinc oxide is going to be your best bet. This one also includes turmeric, ferulic acid, and vitamin C for all those anti-aging properties. I like how it dries down quite matte on the skin, but is still moisturizing. The problem that I have with a lot of natural mineral-based sunscreens is that they use a lot of heavy oils in them sometimes. You know, I love my botanical oils, but I don't necessarily want to put castor oil on my face because it is quite heavy and I tend to break out from it. Maybe it works for someone else. Um, so this one doesn't have castor oil. It has other things, so it's not fully uh, botanical but it lists also on EWG as a number one. So um, I'm liking this a lot. Oh, a tip to applying it when you first put it on, it definitely looks like there's gonna be a major white cast, but just keep working it and patting it in and it totally goes away. Last thing on my list is a wellness supplement. I love wellness supplements. I love adaptogens, I love nootropics. I add them to coffee, smoothies, everything. These are things like reishi mushroom or ashwagandha or you know, gin, ginger, ginseng, things that are very much um, used for medicinal, just general health purposes, especially in other countries. I lived in Asia, so I see it all the time. Um, and are now popping up in beauty and wellness in the States much more often. So this one is Om. Um, this is their Beauty Plus Hair, Skin and Nails. It is a strawberry lemonade supplement that you can put in your water, super easy. The major ingredients are an organic mushroom blend powered with Om Chaga, King Trumpet, collagen, biotin, and vitamin E. The collagen is marine collagen. So if you are vegan and you're not interested in marine collagen, I will list below another one of their products that is vegan. Um, I don't have a problem with uh, marine collagen, so I'm gonna try this. Biotin, if you don't know, is another B vitamin. It's amazing for growing your hair and your nails. So I have friends who have taken biotin supplements and said like, my hair is growing so much better and my nails are strong. So I'm very excited to try this. Chaga, I have actually been taking for quite some time because of its anti-cancer properties. I've read a lot about it. As well, it's known for being a beauty mushroom. It's very, very high in antioxidants, like probably higher than anything else, which is kind of a surprise. So I'm really excited to start using this. Let me get the water. I usually don't like little packages, but anyway, I 
want to try this. And so you put it in your water. You add. Ooh. All right. I'm sure you're supposed to mix it up better. Mmm. Mmm. So it's really good. It's kind of like, um, what you imagine like a mixed drink to taste like. I think it tastes great. You might not think so, um, but I'm very happy to find something that it, like hits all the bases for beauty. So that would be collagen, vitamin E, biotin, plus the mushrooms, the magic mushrooms. So, so that's a really cool, easy way to take a beauty supplement. Cheers. So happy I could bring this video to you to show you some very affordable skincare items that are available to you in 150 countries. Don't forget to check the data box below. You can see everything in the shopping cart. If you like this kind of video, please click the thumbs up, subscribe, and comment below what you love to see or if you've tried any of these things. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye, guys. Mwah.